A lot of people, or most people nowadays, can't exist outside of meaning. See, meaning, if you're obsessed with it, it means you have a lack of meaning in your life. The unexamined life is not worth living, right? So a lot of people are obsessed with titles. Titles will always show to those who are sensitive and capable enough of seeing things beyond a certain facade. Titles and your obsession towards those titles will always show what you actually lack. See, a lot of people, they can't have a relationship without tagging you somehow. You must be their boyfriend or their girlfriend, right? Because technically you're not their boyfriend or girlfriend, right? You are just their necessity. They have a lack of attention, right? People who call you their dear, who call you, you know, boyfriend, girlfriend or any name related to such titles, right? They show that they actually have a lack, right? When they have an extreme lack or any lack. The point is, you're just the tool to be used, right? You're just a tool that is currently partly solving their lack, right? Because if they find the moment they find someone who fulfills this lack much better than you, you will instantly be discarded. This is observable or probably people will recognize when they get ghosted. See, people when they ghost you, they're having other people right, who they are interested in, because they fulfill their needs more, right, they feel their karmic needs more, it's not that they want love, most of the people who are obsessed with meaning, they want someone to break them out of their ignorance, and that can only be done when going through extreme pain, that's why people will always choose narcissistic people, or <coughs> any other type, right, of abusers, because they're not looking for love, they need to realize what love is, and in order to do that, they need to be broken out of the comfort of the misery that they are in. The karmic structure, the meaning that they have created needs to be broken before they acquire a certain level of grace, because only through grace can you ask for other people's help, only through grace can you understand what love is, right, and what gratitude is. But. If you have a lot of nonsense, a lot of meaning in your mind, that will always blot out grace, it will always blot out things like that. So that is why you will get ghosted, because those people need to go through certain levels of pain, they need to go through certain levels of abuse, to break the karmic cycles that they have created, and that have been created and implanted in their mind, through this life, and especially through countless of previous lifetimes. So that is why you alone won't be able to shake them out of there, irrespective of how much love you'll want. The more you stay in contact with those poison people, the more of their poison you'll also attract, and the less grateful you will become, right? The more miserable you'll become as well. Show me the closest five people to you, and I can tell you who you are, right? That was a very, very great uh, quote, that successful people are highly knowledgeable of. You'll see that successful people have very few acquaintances. They may have a lot of friends on their social media, but their social media don't say anything specific about them. Right? And they don't say anything specific about anyone. All you see on social media is just pictures. You don't know if those pictures depict the real person, or you don't know if those pictures are faked at least a bit or not. Right? You don't know when those pictures were told. You have some numbers, but those numbers don't reflect the reality. Those numbers were specifically made to reflect a necessity within you. The uh, occult part of social media is to wake you up by confusing you so much that you enter a certain level of pain through which you will break out, or you will seek to break out from it. You will see that people in time will quit uh, social media because they will have reached that level when they want to move past it. They want to move past that layer of confusion and that layer of necessity for a personality, right? People nowadays have a need for a personality, right? For a mask or a set of masks through which they will make themselves known to the world, right? They are obsessed with fitting or still fitting in this sick society that wants to, nothing else than to kill you. And they still want to fit in somewhere, because it is comfortable. It's been comfortable for thousands of lifetimes, right? For thousands and thousands of generations before us. And therefore, that level of comfort is still wanted, 
right, by the mind, because the unconscious mind always wants you to be uh, calm and comfortable. But true calmness can be achieved through a conscious way, not unconsciously. And, well, the moment you slip back into unconsciousness, well, all the aspects of your forefathers, right, and your previous lifetimes will want you to uh, tend back to that layer of uh, comfort, right, that layer of ignorance where there is no uh, responsibility. There is nothing that challenges you, right, because society has been uh, created in such a way that it numbs you down so that you don't think of anything and the idea of a revolution or the idea of a change of how this sick society is won't even be a possibility of thought in your mind, right? That's how narcissists want to function because they don't like change. They like certain change but only if it is imposed by them and since narcissists don't exist, they are full slaves of their own necessities, well, change can only exist based on their own necessities. So, in this sick society, the titles that you are so obsessed with only represent necessities that you have. So, please tell me what your titles are and what your entitlements are, right? So that I can easily read you. Not that a lot of people can't easily read you, because a lot of people are very sensitive to this life. When you are sensitive to life, you can easily feel people as if you'd be one and the same with them. So hopefully this video has raised a bit of awareness. You are appreciated. Take care. Feel free to view any other content on this channel. Take care. And these being said, Ferengian Board signing out.